ambiguous A S M R. Oh, someone's coming. Hey, could you? Please don't run. I actually need a hand right now. Yes, I know how it looks. I'm a Lamia, poised in the trees above you, in the woods. I get it. It looks sketchy. But I know for a fact. We're about a five minute walk from town. And like I said, I actually need your help right now. Well, your eyes don't deceive you. I am, in fact, Alamia. Like I said, something a lot of people don't seem to notice. However long my tail is, they don't seem to notice. It's 25, 30 feet long. Something like that. Oh, and like two feet around. It's a lot of tail to keep track of. As a matter of fact, it's just gotten wedged. It's stuck between two branches, trying to pull them apart, but they're actually really solid. And they're digging into my scales. A lot. I have tried moving. Like I said, they're digging into my scales. It actually really hurts when I try to move. I'm not. Okay, maybe I'm kind of being a baby. A tiny bit. But. I think you underestimate how much of a constant annoyance having 30 feet of tail trailing behind you at all times is. People are always stepping on it, or dropping things on it, or tripping over it. It's a big reason why you don't see Lamias in towns. Not fun getting your tail trodden on or run over. Which happens a lot, I'll have you know. So, you want to help me? I don't want to be in the dark too long. My body temperature will start to drop. Yes, I'm a reptile. Or reptile enough to be cold-blooded. You wouldn't happen to have a handsaw or machete or hatchet on you. Would you? No? Well, that was a long shot anyway. I should be able to push this branch, and you can push that one. That way I should be able to get loose. Well, nothing's going to happen if we don't try. You think I should just crush them with my coils? Maybe, if I were a constrictor. However, I'm a viper. These coils aren't so... crashy. I can't believe what I'm hearing right now. Of course I'm not going to bite you. I need your help. Killing you isn't exactly going to help. As well as the fact that would be murder. I don't want the cops on me while I'm stuck here. I appreciate the casual speciesism, though. Okay, yes. I know I said how it looks. But there are many hurtful stereotypes. Mostly spread by weirdos on the internet. Got to love them. Sorry, just lost my temper. Just, please climb up here. It'll take two minutes. I promise. Thank 
you. All right. On the count of three, I'll push on this one, and you push on that one. One, two, three. Ah, I'm out. Finally. That is such a relief. All right, well, thank you. Do you want a drink or something? It'll be on me. Well, yes, you helped me. I have to do something to repay you. I can't think of anything you'd want that I own, but humans like drinking, right? I have noticed enough of you limp out here some nights reeking of cheap beer. Although, I'm not one to talk, being a snake and all, but I don't think it's good for you to regurgitate that much. You're not a drinker. Then, what is it that you would like? You want one of my scales? That's... Weird. And painful. You can't just pluck them out like I'm a chicken. There's one stuck on. Oh, look at that. One stuck in the branch. All right. You can keep that one. I still don't get why you'd want it. But I suppose that's not my business. It's not really mine anymore, anyway. I mean, I shed my entire skin several times throughout my life. You learn quickly not to be sentimental. So, thanks again. Enjoy that. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going to keep sneaking off. Farewell, human.